What is up everyone, welcome to the channel's newest series, Raw Ramen. This series will go over anything from speculation of Nintendo news and or your ideas if you guys leave a comment. This is completely unedited commentary, hence Raw Ramen. This just in, we have a new Nintendo Direct, something we haven't had in a while and apparently it's going to be a massive one. We don't have much info on it currently, we do know it's clocking around 45 minutes, it's going to be focusing on the Switch and 3DS, and more information on Super Mario Odyssey. 45 minutes, man, that's a while. If you guys think back, the, I think it was the Nintendo E3 press conference, which was only 25 minutes, and that was jam-packed with games. So think what we're going to be getting in 45 minutes. First thing I thought when I heard this, um, 2018 is approaching, and that's when Nintendo's online service is going up, so they're probably going to announce things like YouTube, Netflix, uh, voice chat without iPhone, hopefully, I, I'm really wishing for that, and I know a lot of you guys are too. Um, the rumored achievement awards, like the Xbox system where they had achievements for doing certain things in game, possibly new controllers themed to upcoming games like Super Mario Odyssey, Mario Kart, basically anything Mario related. Maybe they might announce products for virtual reality like we discussed in the code from the Switch system that strongly pointed towards VR on the Switch. I think a large portion will be devoted for things on the system like um, accessories or regular everyday applications such as Crunchyroll, the Netflix but only for anime or Hulu and Amazon Prime. I actually had the idea, since Neverse was discontinued, they might make a new online posting service, which would come bundled with the online paid service. And speaking of the paid service, a feature I thought would be really cool is the ability to pre-order games through the eShop, so when the game releases, it would automatically download, and we would not have this Platoon 2 eShop crash disaster again. I know a couple of you were on stream when we did that, we were like 87 minutes in from the actual release, and it, it just took forever to get in. It crashed so many times. Um, information we just talked about, it's not going to take that long, maybe max 20 minutes, so that leaves a lot of room for games. Games I think everyone would like to hear about, the HD Pokemon game, the rumored Pokemon Stars, or possibly a completely new series, uh, or title in the series for the next generation up from Sun and Moon, and Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. Uh, Metroid Prime 4, really nice to see actual gameplay and get a feel for the new story, I think it's been a decade since an actual uh, Metroid Prime game came out, Metroid Prime Federation Force does not count, it's a 3DS title, one Samus isn't even in the game, and everyone just really hated it, I thought the concept was really cool, one just because it was a first person shooter, two it had to do with energy guns, and who doesn't like energy guns? Maybe a new Call of Duty title like World War II, I know that we haven't had a uh, Call of Duty title on a Nintendo system in a while. We had speculation before since you could link your Nintendo Network account to your Call of Duty account, so maybe World War II will be coming up, hopefully. I really want a FPS title on the Switch. Super Smash Bros. Deluxe. Maybe at least three or more new characters, that would be very awesome. Uh, possibly the Subspace Emissary, I think that's what it's called, don't quote me on it, I'm not completely sure. Uh, a new storyline would be really cool. And maybe some ports for classic games like Ocarina of Time, Pokemon X, and Splatoon 1. Maybe not Splatoon 1, because they just announced, or rather, released Splatoon 2, so that's probably not going to come out anytime in the near future at least. New information on games I would like to see. Up first, Splatoon 2, hands on. It's my favorite game. That's like the only game I've streamed, um, not including the Black Ops 2 when I just got really bored. It was like 11 o'clock. But maybe they will go over all those leaked weapons like the new Tetra Duelies and the Squeezer. And the fact that you might be able to play as Octolings, we've gone over the code of Oct boy and oct which is octo boy and um what's uh, octo girl and we have i don't i'm not sure if it's official there's a uh di 
not not diagram, a 3D model of the Octoling's hair. So that was leaked. We don't know if it's official. Uh, we don't know where it came from either. So that could be fake. Plus the new ranked game mode with the victory nozzle. I'm not sure what that's about still either. Possibly new amiibo for games like ARMS, Metroid Prime 4, that'd be really sick, Kirby amiibo for the new 3DS title, or amiibo for something like Minecraft. I'm not sure if I would buy something from Minecraft amiibo, but it'd just be nice that they are uh, supporting different titles, different from the Nindies or uh, First Party. Information on the second DLC pack for Legend of Zelda Breath of the Wild. I don't think we have... Um, a release date for that yet that'd be really nice to get a feel for when it's gonna be released uh, when I have time because I still haven't even played the first DLC or completed the whole first game uh, storyline I think I completed the uh, main storyline I haven't completed all the side quests or anything I'm still really into that I think I'm like 150 hours I haven't played it since Splatoon 2 came out that's just because Splatoon 2 is like super addicting but hopefully we get a release date so maybe we can stream uh, me playing that and uh, I'll be able to get through it before the second DLC. I'm not even sure what, what else they would put in it, maybe like a new storyline, it's like maybe a half, like a, a mini side quest storyline, um, I'm not really sure. Speaking of which, it may just be me but I would love to hear about an HD remake port for an older Kirby game. Uh, from like the Wii, I would play that. I thought the titles on the 3DS were really fun. I played both of the Kirby games. Oh, wait, was there three? I think I played the, the two main ones. I think Woolly World is the one that came out already or is being announced. I'm not completely sure. Um, but yeah, the, the Kirby games were really fun. I don't think I finished the Wii games, but you know, Kirby, he's just fun. Who, who doesn't like Kirby? Speaking of HD remakes, uh, maybe some HD remakes for Legend of Zelda will make it to the Switch. Who knows? There's a lot of speculation here since we don't know much about the Direct, which, by the way, is occurring on Wednesday, I believe, 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. I'm trying to get a new setup for the stream so we can all watch that together, react to it, and um, talk about it afterwards. But thank you guys all for watching. I know some of you guys were asking for longer videos, so here it is. Uh, this new series is a great solution since I don't have to spend a lot of time editing, so they will come out way more frequently. Don't forget guys, if you have thoughts or speculations, you can definitely put it in the comments. Click that in the cold ramen if you haven't to see more videos like these, and I'll see you guys in the next one.